All right, so back in the garage, um, I started uh, doing more sanding. I got the passenger side all sanded up. Got that all sanded down. Um, have the wheels still sitting in there. So far I started, uh, I'm gonna take out the, the rear window. Um, I already pulled the metal trim out of the groove and I just started to put a screwdriver in the corner and then push the lower portion of the, uh, the window out. So I kinda got it started. So I'm gonna go back inside and start pushing more and then probably go on the outside and uh, pull the rest of the window out, but I'm gonna start with that. So once I pulled off the, the outer metal trim, all I did was stuck a screwdriver inside here, got underneath the, the seal, and then started to, to pry out while I was pushing. So I got it, I got it started pretty good. You can see it's, uh, I got the corner, corner going. A lot of this is pretty loose already. I'm gonna try to get the top of this done, and then I should be able to go outside and pull it, pull the rest of it out. Yeah, I should be able to go outside and pull the rest of it out. Once I got this little bit started, it was super easy. Because I think it'll come out right now. So I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna go in the back of the truck and pull the rest of it out. So now, I should just be able to pull this out. like that that's the rear uh, window out I'm gonna keep this I just wanted to get it out of the truck because I have some uh, dents here that I want to fix the uh, if you can see used to be a cab on the back of the truck and I filled the the holes that had a, a seal here but there's like some dents from, I don't know if it's from the, the cab hitting the truck or what, but there's dents all along here. Like three or four. I want to try to fix those, but I also wanted to look and make sure because like there's a little rust in spots. I wanted to make sure that was all good before I, because uh, like I said, I'm, I'm sanding it down as, as much as I can probably, probably from here up. I'm not going to worry too much about inside the bed. But I wanted to for surely get this area up, stuff that you can see. If there's some rust, I want to try to take care of it, but I just want to clean it up for while I'm doing so much paint. I didn't want to just mask around the, the seal. So, so yeah, that's that out of there. So now that that's out, I can uh, pull the, this other piece off. I already pulled the... Uh, um, driver side off when I was doing the uh, the inner rocker repair, but I kind of want to pull this side off because I don't know if I'm gonna use it or not. But I want to get it off and out of the truck for so it's not in the way. out of there as far as the the rest of the truck I'm probably gonna uh, clean up and uh, clean up all the inside throw some primer on it so then the the inside will be just done and then whenever I get to uh, doing the outer body work then I will just uh, prime 
or I'll mask it all up the windows so that I'm not getting anything inside of here. So I have some like uh, um, 2K primer I can just, epoxy primer I can just spray on all this stuff so then all this stuff is good, ready to go. And then uh, if I need to scuff anything up to uh, um, alter or weld anything, so be it. But I want to get something on the inside of this so that the inside's all done. Um, yeah, moving right along. All right, so the, now that that's out, I'm gonna hand sand around the, uh, the rear window here. Um, all these areas I didn't hit with the, the orbital sander. So not a ton done, but I got all this sanded up around and then you can see like where the dents are. Like there's one here, little spot there, little spot there, there's a dent, there's a dent there, and one right there, a little spot there. Basically all these are low spots. I might uh, I might try to fix those, I'm not sure. Um, that or, they're not too low. That or they'll just get filled or whatnot. Um, so yeah, other than that, I didn't do much more. I sanded on these, uh, the taillight buckets. I did both those, sanded them down pretty good. Um, but yeah, that's about it for now. Um, I will be back at a different time to do some more work, but yeah, stay tuned.